Welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a makeup tutorial on the look that I am wearing today. I actually busted out my new Anastasia, Be Anastasia Beverly Hills Shadow Couture Palette. I have been using this since I got it and I am just head over heels for it. I don't own too many Anastasia um, uh, shadows or palettes because I don't absolutely love them but this one is just it's my favorite so far especially this one which is uh, pink champagne which I think it's everybody's favorites so I created this halo look using all of these colors right here if you guys want to see more tutorials with this palette let me know and I will film more if you want to learn how to get this really nice halo smoky type of eye then just keep on watching I'm just gonna place my NYX base all over my eye Then I'm going to take Soft Peach. I'm going to be applying this pretty much on the crease. And then I'm going to take a vanilla shade and apply it to my brow bone just to highlight. I'm going to take Morocco and I'm going to be applying it to the outer and inner corner only. Then I'm going to go in with Intense Glaze and I'm going to be applying it on top of Morocco. Then I'm grabbing a clean blending brush and I'm just going to start blending those colors. I'm not going to bring them in because this is where our middle color is going to be. Now I'm going to take this Luxie brush, this is the 213 eye shading, and I'm going to take my e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Sets, and I'm going to wet my brush. I'm going to pick up Pink Champagne, and I'm going to be applying that to the middle of our eye. I'm going to take this brush again and this is no specific brand. I'm just going to be blending in again the outer corner and the inner corner to that pink champagne color. I'm going to go in with the color Noir and I'm just going to take a tiny bit and I'm going to use the Luxie 237 blending and I'm going to create and I'm going to create a little bit of depth into the eye.
Then I'm gonna go in and curl my eyelashes and apply mascara. First, I'm gonna take my eyelashes. These are Grand Glamour by Ilore. Uh, they, co they collaborated with Vegas Nay from Instagram. So these are the ones that I'm going to be using today. Next, I'm going to take my NYX Angel Veil and I'm just going to prime my face. take my fit me foundation this is a matte and poreless and I'm gonna take this flat kabuki brush by beauty junkies Then I'm going to go in with this NARS Creamy Concealer in the color Medium Ginger. I'm just going to take my flat top kabuki brush and use this to blend everything out. And I'm quickly going to set that with this Your Minerals Transparent Veil. And I'm going to be using my e.l.f. blush brush to set that. Now I'm going to move on to contouring. I'm going to use the Nikki Garrett's Contour Duo in the color Medium with my e.l.f. angled blush brush. Now for bronzer, I'm going to go in with this Milani Baked Bronzer in the color Soleil and I'm going to take this Visanti Blush Brush number 7. I'm going to take this Wet n Wild Blush in the color Berry Shimmer and I'm just going to be applying the tiniest bit to my cheeks just to give a little bit more color and I'm going to use that same brush. Now for my highlights, I'm going to take this Luxie Beauty Highlights in the color Bombshell and I'm going to take the Sedona Lace FB01 and this is just my current obsession. I love this highlights. And to finish off the eyes, I'm going to be doing the same steps as I did above as to the lower lash line. Now to finish off the look, I'm going to go in with this ColourPop Ultra Matte Lippy and this is in the color Solo. It's like a nice pink. We'll see how it looks. If not, then we can change it. I think I want this a tad bit lighter, so I'm going to take a little bit of vice and apply it to the center and then just spread it out to give it like that ombre effect. So after you apply your lipstick, you are done with this look. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And that is everything for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in my next video.